Hi, I'm Brian Correa, and if you want to watch BYU sports, you're on the right channel. This is True Blue on BYU TV. Well said. Welcome back to the show. Senior running back Brian Correa ready for the home opener on Saturday. And as you will see, he's hoping this last season at BYU will be one he never forgets. Going through football camps, probably, I've never been in the military, but I imagine it's probably something like boot camp is 24 seven, everything's about football. It basically just envelops everything that you do for a month. I'll be honest, my, uh, my first fall camp out here was, was kind of rough. I kind of felt like I was alone at first, and I actually, one day I separated my shoulder, and I just was, I felt like I was beat down. I, I was getting sick. I didn't feel like I was doing anything worth out on the field. Uh, and so it was tough, you know, it was, it was kind of a struggle that first camp, but I'm glad I, I stuck it out. <laughs> to be honest, I feel like sometimes camp just kind of runs together. The days kind of melt into each other. When you get an opportunity to take a step back and look at just how lucky we are to be where we are and to have the opportunity to play football at this level, I think is invigorating and energizing. Anybody that's played football can, can relate to the experience that it, it just gets something deep inside you starts uh, almost boiling up and the excitement and uh, the anticipation for the game, you know, that first game, uh, I think really starts to surface. You know, it's, it's kind of a sad thought, I think, to, uh, to realize that this is the last, the last year that I'm gonna be playing here. I spent a lot of time and effort and work and energy trying to contribute to this program, trying to represent the school as best I can. And I'm just looking to have a positive experience throughout the entire thing, not worrying too much about really anything, but just having fun and enjoying this, uh, this last opportunity I had to play football with a lot of my good friends, uh, some of the best friends I have in the world.